electric car makers always claim their tech is advanced and way ahead. But is building an electric car really harder than building a gas car? The truth is, making a solid gas car still depends on high-end foreign machine tools. Many key machines cannot be replaced locally, and that raises production costs. For example, in the Volkswagen EA211 engine, the first crankshaft step is cleaning the end face and opening the center holes. This uses a machining center from Spain, and the cutting tools come from Germany. Next, the machine that turns the main journals is made in Germany, with a cutter plate from the United States. One rotating tool plate handles different cutting heads so it can work on different areas of the crankshaft. Then we turn the second and fourth main journals, and the connecting rod journals. This step also uses German equipment. The accuracy here has to be extremely tight. If the connecting rod slots are even slightly off, the rods will wear faster, and the engine will not last as long. Next, we drill the oil passages inside the crankshaft. This uses a deep drilling machine from Spain and drill bits from Germany. These passages move oil from the main journal to the connecting rod journals for smooth lubrication. Then comes heating and quenching. A high-frequency hardening machine from Germany heats the crankshaft surface to around 1,000 degrees, then cools it fast. This creates a hardened layer that boosts strength and wear resistance. Next, we drill weight reduction holes using another Spanish machine. Hollow sections lower the crankshaft's weight and reduce centrifugal force while it spins. Then we grind the main journals and the connecting rod journals. This step uses a double-wheel grinder from the United Kingdom. While the wheels handle precision grinding, an Italian measuring head checks accuracy in real time. After that, we balance the crankshaft with a German dynamic balancing machine. It finds weight differences in different directions, then removes material by drilling so the crankshaft can spin smoothly. The final step is polishing. A fully automatic polishing machine from Germany gives the crankshaft a smooth finish. This cuts friction, lowers power loss, saves fuel, and helps the engine last longer. Now that you have seen how complex a gas engine really is, do you think electric cars can truly pull ahead in technology?